VLAB is a platform by which Georgia Tech students, faculty, and staff can access software for free. It has MATLAB, Adobe Creative Suite, and much more. This video will show you how to use VLAB. To start, go to mycloud.gotech.edu. If you already have the Citrix Receiver plugin, go ahead and log in with your GTID and password. You may be asked by your browser to detect the Citrix Receiver. Go ahead and download and install it if you don't have it, and then come back to this login page if you're not automatically redirected. After you've installed the receiver and logged in, this is your home page. To get to the software you want, select Desktops at the top of the screen. Choose Library 2019. Depending on your status or major here at Tech, there may be other desktops available to you. Agree to the terms of use, and it will load a Windows desktop. Now you can scroll into the apps and see what's available. There's a lot to choose from. Anything you save on VLAB will stay there. But you can't drag files from your desktop computer to VLAB and back again. You will need to use Dropbox or some kind of physical drive to move files between your computer and VLAB. When you're done with VLAB, just save your work wherever you want it to live. Then you can log off using the Windows Start menu in the bottom left hand of the VLAB screen. Since VLAB is a cloud tool, connectivity and responsiveness can vary based on the number of users in the system. I've always had the best experience using it in the early evening, when most folks are probably eating dinner. 